By the mid-1980s, David had experienced two short-lived marriages and a number of brief relationships, one of which resulted in the birth of his first child, Katie, but they soon became estranged. Divorce settlements and a series of bad investments left him half a million dollars in debt. He had nothing and he was turning to alcohol. He actually confessed to having blackouts. But in 1991, salvation came in the form of a third wife, Sue Schifrin. And together they became parents to son, Bo. That, to David, was the most wonderful moment of his life when Bo was born. He wanted to make sure his son got the love he didn't get. No, you're not listening. What did I tell you? But despite attempts to remain sober, David continued to battle with his alcoholism. This came to a very public head on November 3rd, 2010, when he was arrested for driving under the influence. One night on the evening news, I watched a California state trooper pulling David over in the car and giving him a DUI. Keep going, keep going. It was hard for us to watch, see his mug shot. What he does in response to a stressful event is he begins to drink. And this happens time and time again. 